How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here and today we are going to play some Scythe. That's right, we're going to play Scythe Legends only today and we might as well do Strike Out. That way we can choose three different Scythe Legends every single match. Though we may not get to use all three of them if we don't even get to our last stock, but that's okay. We're going to have fun anyways. So some of you may be wondering like, what are the three best Scythe Legends in the game? Well, if you had to ask me which three were the best, that's actually a really hard question, but I would put Volkov up there. I would put Fate up there and probably Mordex. Although I also really do like Moonin. I like Artemis. I like Nyx. I like Mirage. Uh, there's a lot of good Scythe Legends. Jiro is pretty fun. So we're going to just go ahead and kind of mix and match and... Uh, yeah, let's just, let's just do something like this for the first match. We're going to do Verdant Bloom colors because we're in that spring of things, if you know what I mean. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Dude, my hair is like, is so like bright. <laughs> I don't even know. Like, it's kind of reminds me of Lemonade. All right, we're going against uh, Core. I didn't actually see which legends he chose, but we're going all Scythe today. Haven't really been giving Scythe a whole lot of love lately, so... We're going to play some Scythe. All right. Do you want a weapon? Yes or no, uh, Core? All right. He got the weapon. Now we're going to go in for the kill. Oh, man. That was a perfect read on the neutral sig. Oh. I love it when I hit that move with Core, the uh, gauntlet neutral. But you definitely don't want that hit on you because it can kill pretty easily. Ooh, Jiro. He has low defense, but he makes up for it with really good attacks. Look at the reach on that. Oh, watch out, Hattori. We're coming at you with the thousand swings of the scythe. Oh, man. Oh, man. This is a absolute destruction of a, of a game. I mean, I'm letting him get the weapon every time, so it's not like I'm being unfair. I don't even have to let him get the weapon. I'm doing it to be nice. This is actually fun practice, though. If you want to get better at a weapon, play every legend that has the weapon. Like, if you want to get better with Scythe, just play all the Scythe legends. You can focus on one after a while, like once you figure out which is your favorite. But you don't have to focus on one right away if you don't want to. I have fun playing every legend, I think. Oh, get that out of here. You try to neutral sig me? Get that out of here. But yeah, I think if you play all the legends, you'll find one that you like the best. Uh, GG, dude. GG. That was fun. Uh, we literally only got to play Zero there. <laughs> Let's start it out with Enchantress this time, which is a epic crossover for Fate. Then we're going to go to Volkov, and then we're going to finish it out with Moonin. How about... I want to go Magpie Moonin, because that's my favorite Moonin. Let's go Skyforge colors. Why not? Whoo! Going against Moonin right off the bat. I might not sound like it, but I'm actually super tired right now. <laughs> I, didn't <laughs> I didn't actually sleep that well last night, but... It's okay, because whenever I play Brahalla, I can feel the blood pumping, I feel I feel it, and we're gonna we're gonna wake up just fine. Oh my gosh. Down sig! What? How did that down sig not hit? I will not know. Normally, if I down sig and they are like right on it, normally I hit with that. One tip I will give with Scythe is when you're up in the air, like don't always just go for a down air. It can be good. Like you want to use down air a lot, but use more neutral side, like anything but a down air because they'll predict the down airs and they'll start to like bait you out for them basically oh, I thought he would dodge down but oh I tried to pick that back up I wanted that orb uh 
Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Not like this. Wait, how did he get back up like that? Sheesh. Gauntlets are kind of OP. Kind of surprised that didn't hit him at all, but... All right, you must die now, Onyx. You straight up to heaven. <laughs> Goodbye. I love doing that down stick because you could send them up or you could send them sideways. It... it is your choice. Oh, that was a lot of damage there. We might, oh my goodness, I just realized we're looking at a three stock. We might get two three stocks in a row. Oh my goodness, this is a close. Oh, nope. I thought maybe I could surprise him with that because I hadn't used the side sig all game, but that's okay. We finally get a new legend, Volkov. I actually like Volkov a lot. He's one of my favorites, so I think even if we win this pretty quickly, which we should. Oh, okay. I don't know why he was taunting, but sorry about that, dude. Well played, dude. Well played. I was going to say, I want to start this game with Volkov because he's one of my favorite legends. And, uh, yeah. Sorry, Deadly Sierra. I'm not going to accept that invite. <laughs> I've tried to play other different people every time. Let's do Bordex. So I'm going to do Fedrir. No, nah, everybody does Fedrir. Let's do something different. I like Octavius Bordex level 1, but with, like, different scythe. Let's do that. And then uh, how about Artemis? Artemis is actually one of my favorite characters as well. I really, really, really like Future Spirit Artemis, which is a... Uh, Christmas skin, I believe. Comes out around uh, holiday time there. All right, we're going against Bubs a lot. He's playing Yumiko, Ada, and Lord Vrax. So two Blaster Legends and then Yumiko, which has Hammer and Bow. Kind of a nice variety of Legends there. What are these hitboxes? Oh, I did not mean to throw that. All right. There it is. Just got to read where they're jumping. Go in for it and uh, don't do anything too crazy. We're actually doing pretty good. Oh my gosh, I did not expect that move to counter. Nice, nice, nice. I love that Ada skin. I forget what it's called, but it's from the last battle pass and it looks so clean. Those aren't my favorite colors on it, but All right, let's stop playing on the edge. That's getting silly. Woo <laughs> Two little side airs is all it took. His blasters are good. I can see why he chose to do two blaster legends. 
He also is good at dodging the scythe, which makes me think that he probably knows how to play scythe. Because he kind of knows like what I'm going for, basically. Uh-oh. Not like this, Mordex! Whoa! Dang it. I really wanted to finish with Mordex, but that's okay. We have Future Spirit Artemis. The best part about play is Strikeout. One of my characters dies. That just means I get to use the next. You know what I mean? Like, it's they're all fun to me, so... GG, dude. GG. Sir Bubs a lot. I feel like he should have a sir in front of his name. Sir Bubs a lot. All right, that was fun and all, but let's play some different Scythe Legends. How about we start it out with Nyx this time? I'm feeling uh, Retro Reaper Nyx. Why not? This is one of the best looking skins, in my opinion. And then uh, we already did Jiro. How about. Mm, I think we already did like every Scythe Legend now, guys. I don't think we actually got to play Moon in, though, so I'm going to go Moon in second. I'm just doing random weapons here. Yeah, we didn't get to play Moonin, and uh, I don't think we actually got to really play Artemis that much either, so I'm just going to do Artemis again. This time, though, Charge Doji colors. They look so good. All right, here we go. Let's see who we're going against. Binks. By the way, guys, if you enjoyed the content, please go ahead and drop a like. It really helps out the channel, and I greatly appreciate it. All right, Binks. Let's see how Binks does against the Scythe Squad. Whoa, I did that the wrong way. Otherwise, I probably would have hit. Ooh. I didn't actually, like, expect that side sig to reach that far. I'm not used to playing Nyx, to be honest. I don't player all that much but I I see why people like her because she has amazing weapons I like blasters and scythe and her sigs are just fun Banks oh that was so close Banks I like this, Binks. Why so mean? Oh, uh, oh well. Nyx did a good job. Nyx got Binks to his second sock halfway, so that's all we really needed out of Bink out of uh, out of Nyx. Oh my goodness, that bow! was in the air for what felt like an hour before it finally hit. Banks, you need to unbind, pick up with light attack. That is such a bad, bad uh, bind. Like, if especially, if, I don't know if he plays with controller, but I play with controller, obviously, and like, you definitely want to have pick up with light attack unbound because you want to pick up with weapon throw. Sometimes you want to attack without picking up basically. Ouch. Hard to beat a hammer ground pound. Ooh. All right. We got future spirit Artemis again. Artemis closed out the win for us last time. So I'm thinking she'll do it again. But I got to be really careful going against the hammer when I have scythe, you know what I mean? Get out of here, Banks! Yeah. 
Yeah. <laughs> got her with the side air. Well played, dude. Well played. Or got him. All right, guys. I think we pretty much played every single legend that's a scythe legend. Let's see. We played Mirage, Nyx, Mordex, Artibus, Moonin. We played Volkov. We played Fate. And we played Zero. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure we played every scythe legend. Hopefully, I didn't forget one. Yeah, I don't think I forgot any. So anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know which weapon you would like me to focus on next video because I love trying different weapons out. And uh, as always, this is Lucian Sword. Thank you for watching. I hope to see you in the next video, friends. Take it easy.